Hello everyone, teacher Jonas here, and today we are going to review Bitmass. Bitmass. I hope you remember what it is. Now, we do things in order. For example, you wear socks first and then you wear shoes. So, socks first and then shoes. You never wear your shoes and then put socks on them. No, you always put on socks and then you put on your shoes. It's the same in mathematics with operations. There is an order. For example, the word bed mass stands for brackets, exponents, but before we go any further, these are for later years maybe next year so we're going to ignore these two and only focus on these four divide division multiply multiplication add addition and then subtract or subtraction so when you see a long operation you must do let's never mind these okay you must do division or multiplication whatever comes first once you're done with all the division and multiplications in an operation then you go to the next ones addition or subtraction now let's see what that means before we go any further again we will talk about only d mass d m a s we are not going to talk about b and e because they are for next year now bet mass has other names pemdas butt mass but we're going to only learn about bet mass today so operations what are they you remember addition subtraction multiplication and division as you remember when there was only addition and subtraction we always went from left to right so we went 40 plus 60 minus 97, blah, blah, blah. We always went from left to right. And when there was only multiplication and division, like this one, 300 divided by 3 times 10, we went from left to right. But what if we mix them together? What if we have something that has multiplication, subtraction, addition, and division all together what do we do do we still go from left to right no 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 we must follow bed mass i know you're like this but maybe not now in the past but now you know how easy it is so we must follow bed mass or just d mass now bit mass this part is division multiplication addition and subtraction so let's start first the most important part we start from here let's see what do we have do we have multiplication and division yes look at here we have multiplication what is 5 times 20 it is easy 100 so now we have 100 minus 25 plus 50 divided by 5 do we go 100 minus 25 no we have a division we have to do division first division and multiplication so 50 divided by 5 is 10 so easy so now 100 minus 25 plus 10 is we go from left to right because it's only subtraction and addition right so it is 75 now 75 plus 10 is 85 we have the answer to this monstrosity 5 times 20 minus 25 plus 50 divided by 5 equals 85. <laughs> All right, let's do another one. 543 minus 212 times 2 plus 63. Oh, what do we do? We must follow bit mass. So we have to do division and multiplication first. We have multiplication here. 212 times 2. So... We follow the mass. So 212 times 2 equals 424. 
So now we have 443 minus 424 plus 63. Now, since it's only subtraction addition, we can go from left to right. So 543 minus 424 is 119. And 119 plus 63 is 182. The answer to 543 minus 212 times 2 plus 63 is 182. Easy. Now, let's do this one. 350 divided by 50 plus 2 times 32 minus 52. Oh. So, we must follow bad mass, right? So, we must do oh division here. So, 350 divided by 5 is just like 35 divided by 5. It is 7, right? So, it's 7. So, now, 7 plus 2 times 32 minus 52. Hey, can I do this now? No. You must do multiplication. So, 2 times... 32, which is 64. So, 7 plus 64 minus 52. Oh, now we can go from left to right. So, let's do it. 7 plus 64. 64 plus 7. What is it? 4 plus 7 is 11. With this, it's 7. 71. So, now it's 71 minus 52. Oh, okay, 71 minus 52. Uh oh, we have to borrow, so this becomes 11. This becomes 6. 11 minus 2 is 9. And 6 minus 5 is 1. So the answer, the final, final answer is 19. Are we correct? Yes, we are. So, you see, knowing bet mass is important. Look, she doesn't know bet mass. She thinks the answer is 8. But no, the answer is not 8. See, 2 plus 2 times 2. Oh, it's not 8. 2 times 2 is 4. And 4 plus 2 is 6. The answer is 6. <laughs> Okay, guys, that is it for today's review of BetMass. I am so proud of all of you. Take care of yourself. If you have any questions, you can always contact me and I will answer any of your questions. Until next time, Teacher Jonas out. Bye-bye, everyone. See you.